College Football Fan Index, sponsored by Goodyear. This week, uniforms. A great uniform is in the eye of the beholder. Uniforms that used to be considered eyesores are now retro classics, and they're pumping out more potential classics than ever. Teams are wearing more combinations than ever before. Some schools wear a different combo every single week. But a few schools still keep it simple. At Alabama, the Crimson Tide have two looks, home and away. The one color look is all the rage. School colors don't even get in the way of a great look anymore. At Maryland last year, the team celebrated the 200th anniversary of the Star Spangled Banner with uniforms inspired by the battle at Fort McHenry, the site of Francis Scott Key's famous bombs bursting in air. And Northwestern wore Gothic-themed uniforms that match signage and architecture on the lakefront campus. Several schools wear the famous winged helmet, but it's most famous because of Michigan. The Wolverines have been wearing the design since 1938, and the color scheme started to help the team. Coach Fritz Chrysler thought the unique look would help the offense more easily identify receivers downfield. With so many new looks debuting every year, uniforms are constantly being designed and redesigned. The folks at Nike headquarters showed us how a uniform goes from concept to the field. The innovation cycle is almost uh, up to three to five years, depending on the type of material that we're using or certain types of things that we're doing through footwear or the amount of testing. So it really varies on the product. This is one of our latest vapor gloves. And if you see when you, you know, it's very, very tight and conforming to put on, but you have little areas of protection because you get stepped on, it has really uh, become part of the game. When you look at helmets, especially helmets aesthetic, there's just a lot of new innovations that have been happening from, you know, some types of paint finishes to, you know, carbon fiber textures added to it, designs brought in through the face mask. This is our, our latest mock speed uniform. So if you look at all of this, is about stretch and recovery, different panels through that, zone ventilation, you get perforations through here, even the number font itself has stretch to it. This is called the uh, Vapor Untouchable, and we work specifically with a lot of the Oregon athletes, including Marcus Mariota on this, and he really liked this whole idea about the knit collar up through there, and that whole proprioception about where he felt like his ankle was in space gave him more feedback to be able to explode when he needed to explode. So some of those things and you know that really fed into the construction and the design of this through just how it felt on the foot and how it worked in the competition. Which team has the best uniforms in college football? Vote in the fan index and you decide.